Hammer. I am from Ireland, but I live now in Venice, California. The first time I ever saw street painting was uh, in Dublin when I was a little kid. I remember seeing somebody paint the Mona Lisa and I, I was totally enchanted. And then later when I went to university, I went to Edinburgh and they had a festival in the summertime there. So I saw people street paint there and that got me interested in it. And then I started traveling around the world. And when I, I started the 3D, when I went to Australia, and I met other people who were starting to, to use the 3D perspective. And um, so it sort of began from there and it gradually evolved over the years. You know, in the early days when I started street painting, I, um, I just used uh, chalk and charcoal and I did, just did sort of giant portraits, quite often local heroes as I traveled around. And more recently I've got interested in sort of going back to the black and white um, and but using the 3D perspective with it and trying to use as much as possible of the pavement itself uh, as the mid-tone. So I push it towards light with the chalk and push it towards dark with the black. When you're on the road and you're traveling, there's so much equipment to take if you're, if you're using all, all the colors and you're painting and using buckets and everything. Um, it's really much, more, uh, much easier to carry and much more efficient to come and go if you just have black and white, chalk and piece of charcoal. I like black and white photography. I've always, I've always preferred black and white photography to color. And um, yeah, so there's a very similar kind of quality that even uh, actually when I do take photographs, I like to use that very grainy film. So um, on the street, you can make that effect of a very grainy black and white photograph um, just with the chalk and charcoal. Well, this experience in Atlantic City has been really great. It's, uh, it's been very well organized and uh, it's, uh, it's, it's been a really nice chance to have a bit of time to spend with some of the other artists as well. Um, when Tracy approached me uh, about coming to, to um, Atlantic City, I just uh, I felt very honored to be a part of the group that was chosen to come here. And, you know, after all these years of working on the street, it's a very special thing to be actually invited to, to, um, to, to do your, your artwork and have a chance to, to be involved with all the other 3D artists. So a uh, special honor for sure.